you know, I guess, again, you know, in this challenging world, you know, we experience so many emotions. And, you know, given the circumstances of what's happening in the world, you know, we cannot help but feel depressed, you know, and it's okay to feel depressed. But, you know, if we remain in this state of depression, it will drag us down. And if it drags you down, it's going to drag everybody else around you. Because again, whatever's going on in you will reflect and manifest in the world around you. Yeah. And so again, you know, I, it's not to say that if you clean, you're not ever going to feel it because, you know, I've been cleaning a long time. But, you know, from time to time, when I see people or I hear things, I watch the news, I do get depressed. And I think to myself, wow, what's going to happen to me and my family or the world with all these things going on? You know, but I have to catch myself and not get stuck in it, you know, and wallow in it and feel like I'm a victim. For me, I have to always remember, you know, self-identity to Ho'oponopono gave me a way out. It gave me hope that if I apply my tools, if I take that responsibility to take action and do it, divinity will come to me and provide what is right and perfect for me, my family, relatives, and ancestors. So again, you know, it's like, just do it. Just clean self, you know, no matter what happens to you, it's about taking good care of yourself, being responsible, and uh, doing repentance, forgiveness, and transmutation. You simply have to make this appeal. And once you do it, you know, divinity takes over. How wonderful to be in the embrace of divinity to solve your problems.